It's not, it's, it's not uh, everyone in this life has the opportunity of having a vision, of having it now completed. And the vision I had when I came here over 60 years ago to have put up an institution for the aged. It's always fun to take a walk with Brother Patrick Corr. He's our favorite living Irish legend. He tells many stories, some about Ireland, but mostly of his 60-year ministry of love at the St. John of God Retirement and Care Center. The heart of the ministry of the Brothers of St. John of God is hospitality, and you can certainly feel it here in the great city of angels and on St. John's seven-acre campus on Western and Adams Streets. Our friend John Gavin gives us a tour. Our first unit with 24-hour nursing care was built in 1952. The St. John Grande Apartments, a superb example of independent living, was finished in 1989. In 2002, we dedicated the St. Richard Pampuri Apartments, which offer residential and assisted care living. We added a new wing to our first building in 1971. It includes the first Alzheimer's care center in Los Angeles. So, Brother Patrick, what's next? Let's take a look, he said. Here we go, back down this pathway to the location of the new Alzheimer's care center, the large area behind the mansion where visitors and staff often parked. This was the last piece of available ground on the campus. The construction started with a big hole in the ground for a big project. This is actually the floor of the center's underground garage. Next came the laying of the rebar over the roof of the garage, the first floor of the center. Once in a while I would get out there myself with my shovel, brother told me. Soon the building took shape. It looked great from the roof of the nursing residence. Now the outside is nearly finished but the inside needs a lot of work before the planned opening in July. Let's take a look. There are large residence rooms, spacious areas for dining and for play, and it will be one of the finest facilities in America. Our Alzheimer's Care Center will also be part of a large research project. John Gavin tells us what it will be like inside. As Brother Patrick says, it will be a very home-like environment. It will have a communal style resident kitchen, laundry room, fireplace, lounge, a media center, craft rooms, pet quarters, a built-in aquarium, and a fountain and gardening center. This residential facility will be devoted to the care of loved ones suffering from Alzheimer's, the progressive degenerative disease that now touches millions of American families with one out of 10 people over 65 years old affected. It is true that we're in, in a great age and America is a young nation, always thinks we'll be a young nation. But you can rest assured we're all grown old and will get old and there'll be always a percentage who will need our assistance. Well, we need, uh, we need quite a lot of money yet. Uh, we're not at the end of the rope. But we do... Uh, we, we would be happy if we could get close to a million more so that we can complete our new building so when they enter the when we take it over it will be free of debt we ask you to help us finish our alzheimer's care project it completes the saint john of god retirement and care center as brother patrick always says come visit us we have some cute outdoor cats and often we have well-known visitors there are many nice warm benches so come and sit, and let's talk for a while. Thank you. I look forward to all paying a visit here and seeing the place for yourself, nothing like first hand, see exactly what we're doing and what we're trying to accomplish. Thank you all. Remembering the words of St. John of God, Deus caritas est, God is charity, we build our Alzheimer's care center with faith, with hope, and in the expectation of your good charity.